Hello everybody, I'm Captain Zeus and welcome back to A Quiet Place, The Road Ahead. Now I know it's been a minute since I have played this game. Been busy, finished up Gears of War 2, super fun. So I want to go ahead and try to finish this game as well as Poppy Playtime before I go ahead and move on to the next one. So we're going to go ahead and dive into here. I think the last time we left off, we were leaving the hospital and we're on our way to figure out or go to the quote unquote new safe haven. Let's hope there's no monsters on the way. I've also completely forgot the controls, so I have no idea what I'm doing. Day 119. I can't go back to it told me to find the train tracks and follow them. Okay. Remember to be careful and check for noisy services to avoid raising the creature's awareness. Oh, it's still around here. Okay, so this is... Okay, I gotta be really quiet. The Tale of the Grey Squirrel's Tale. Cool. Aw, it's a grey squirrel. still around here. Not cool. want to point out that I didn't do that. Touch that. We're doing good so far. Ooh, cutscene. Okay, cool. We can talk. Who's that? Oh, that's the freaking weirdo and... Is that, uh, what's-his-face's mom? an automatic. Okay. That's cool. It's not actually cool. Gotta watch out for those cans. Or 
worst enemy. Oh, goodness, this doesn't look good at all. The bank did told me to find the train tracks and follow them. locked. I guess we're going to have to go around. Dust. A large amount of dust in a specific area can raise the amount of asthma stress. Try to avoid it, and if you can't, try to limit your time in it. Remember that you can use inhalers to have some time of immunity. Okay. Overcome gaps. You can cross large gaps with the help of planks. Place one with F and use, I guess, the cursor to lay it down slowly. The plank must be placed in a in specific spots, but a single plank can be used to overcome multiple gaps. However, it's a heavy object, and going around with it will raise Alex's stress. Okay. Inhaler, nice. Uh, you were busy when I got in. Thanks for the concern. I uh, got the new inhaler. The pills aren't as effective as an inhaler, but they're better than nothing. Cool. Took the large plank out of the pile for a reason until we get this built. Use that plank to cross the gap. Cool. It's really close. 
good stuff. Got inhalers, so that's good. Well, if you need shelter, you can continue the outpost not far from here. Okay.
What's happening? Who's fighting? Oh my gosh! Yeah, I knew it. Alright, that didn't work. I, I thought it would. It didn't. I thought it would. Good golly gee molly, the thing is... So sensitive to sounds. Okay, what the frick am I supposed to be doing here? <sighs> Bro! And I had an asthma attack, dude. I
think we're good. Kinda. I need some batteries for sure. Why is the basement open? Why is the basement open? This doesn't seem like a good plan. Someone's safe home for sure. Jesus. All those people. Oh yeah, a bunch of people died. Dad. Oh god. No, no. Oh, that is what we look like. I thought we looked completely different. safe so should be okay as long as there's no like creepy old man upstairs or something Definitely need, uh, what's it called? S some batteries. Just rummaging through this guy's place. What's that? Oh, I do have batteries. I didn't realize I still had batteries. Okay. I thought I, uh... I didn't think I had any. Okay, cool. Anything else in here? No. Alright.
It's her. It's crazy lady. Okay, she's got her gun. Don't. Oh, we slipped and fell. Oh my gosh, we slipped and fell. Oh my gosh, monster. Oh my gosh, brick. Oh my gosh, what do we do? Okay, throwables. Throwing objects can create a temporary distraction. They can also break obstacles and even open new paths. You decide if it's worth the risk. That's not helpful. I cannot believe that happened. It was it wasn't going to hit there. Come on, dude.
Ridiculous. First Lord and the creature, it's getting worse and worse. She had a gun, but she can't hurt me, right? And as long as I'm expecting her grandchild. Alright, whatever. So far, so good. All right, cool. We're in a cutscene. Thank goodness. Adventure camp. Um, we're there. Holy crap! We gotta go all the way. Oh, the welcome center is where we gotta go? What are we crying about now? What the frick? Ain't nothing to cry about. Dang. We ain't even leave nowhere. Where's Dad? Alright, that was the forest. Good. Day one. Oh, it's a flashback. Hey! Yeah. Mama! That was embarrassing. What happened? Everyone gets overwhelmed sometimes. Oh yeah, that was at the beginning of the game, Did I remember. Sure. You know, I was thinking about not playing this cutscene. But you know what? Since we can talk in this cutscene, why the frick not? Let's enjoy it. Let's enjoy this and, uh... Not have to worry about any monsters. Laura got a fatty. Anyways. This is a really nice place though. Like, Martin? It's a really good place. Oh. During your attack, he didn't know what to do with himself, so I gave him something to do. Hey, she is he really cares walking fast. He's never seen me like that. But you had asthma when you were little. And that was different. And I had it under control by middle school. When did you come back? Um, we're just gonna ignore the the chapel. We go to the chapel. That's really close. That's really close. 
A chainsaw? My mother. I didn't know love could hurt like that. Yeah, love hurts. Don't do it. I was pregnant with Martin. I had to keep going. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You gotta find something to chase, you know. Something to follow. Something to go after. You know, something to lead you along. Something that will never steer you wrong. Always will be right in front of you. Hands full. You know what I'm saying? My lips are sealed. I like how this, these two families are so close together. It's the cliche childhood friend romance trope. Oh, love it. I don't know why we needed a cutscene for that, though. You know, for her walking. What was the point of me walk? I hate that parts of like games where you see last night's game? all you do is like walk like five feet, It'll be a miracle if they make and then it it's another cutscene. Hey, Alex, single or double? Single. Thanks, Robert. I live to serve. And don't you forget it. Oh. Oh. Enchanté. Robert. How you doing, Dad? Good birthday so far? Dad? Hmm? Fine, sweetheart. I'm, I'm fine. Aw. Uh, are you all right? He's struggling. Oh, uh, yeah. I, I just, um... Alex, you mind grabbing the beer? Not at all. <laughs> and thank you for avoiding... Letting me avoid speaking. What do you say, birthday boy? You want one? <laughs> Ooh, I'm about to sneeze. A few moments later... I sneezed. Back of the van. Where's the... And it better be full when he gets here. Just because you're in college doesn't mean you're legal. Is that not how that works? Dang, just leaving a whole shotgun in the trunk. I guess she built the synthesizer. Scrap. Wow. She's always been inventive. What was it that Peppers, Peppers. When she was little. Oh, Poppers. Beautiful technician. That's it. Julia gave her that nickname. Alex, can I uh talk to you for a second? Yeah, sure, buddy. Third year. Yeah, yeah, he'll be flying in no time. Hush. I don't like thinking about him driving a car, let alone flying a plane. All right, you little stinker, you. What you gotta talk about? Hey. Hi. <sighs> Dang, just romance music just dropped I'm heavy. Really sorry. I, I didn't know that you'd... It's okay, really. I just... I, th I thought you'd laugh. You know, on the plus side, you get to brag to all your friends at school. I do? Yeah. You can tell them that you finally took a girl's breath away. That's actually wow. funny. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to say it, but I kind of missed you this year. Yeah? Yeah. Oh. Martin, I can't find the bottle opener. Can you... Ah, oh, mom's out. being a cock blocker. <laughs> Want to help me look? Sure. Or maybe she's helping out. She's like, hey, the bottle opener's in your room. <sighs> you know, the furthest room from the house where no one would hear you scream. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All right. Looking for a bottle opener. All right. Just clicking random stuff. No props. Gotta open that bottle. I don't see. Oh, hey, hey, buddy. Oh, 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 oh you're not, you're not letting me leave. Hey, uh, I, I don't think the bottle opener's in this corner. Oh my gosh, am I actually glitched? Am I stuck? Is he gonna do me right here over this? <laughs> Martin, your parents are home. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of, I'm really stuck here. Crouch. Okay, cool. All it's right, gotta be around here we somewhere. escaped Martin. Yeah, I don't suppose they could use a hammer instead. Not unless they want bits of glass in their beer. Holy shit! I can't believe you had this. Was I supposed to click on this first? It's my mom's. Do you have any idea how rare this is? I don't even know what this is. I'd like it. If you like my music, you'll love theirs. They're like my biggest inspiration. Can oh wait, I Alex legit legit makes uh, music? Will Laura mind if we play it? 
There's the bottle opener, right there. Your music. What? what Come on. It's been a long time since I've heard you sing. You mean now, or? Aw, <laughs> do it. I just wasn't planning on I, I didn't plan for this. Warmed up or... Any excuses. <sighs> no, screw it. All is quiet, all is calm. Oh, the storm isn't gone. I'm not gonna lie, it's kinda cringe. The sun, oh, screw it. And then... Oh, I know what comes next. But just a moment. She can sing, though. I feel warm. She can sing. In the eye of a storm. Alex. Um, anyway, if you liked that, you're gonna love their stuff. It's so cool that you have it on vinyl. I, I, I wanna show you something. Okay. Make sure to take the bottle opener. It's literally right there. I think that's a bottle opener. Come on, Slowpoke, upstairs. What the freak, homie, is fast. It's right there. Slow down. Do you want to give me another asthma attack? <laughs> hey, I'm always down to take your breath away. <laughs> wow, you guys are so funny. Like romantically funny. Man, I wish I knew love. I can't find the um the the hook ladder thing. The hook ladder you thing. See it anywhere? I think it might be in my bed. Wait here. I'll get it. All right, I'll oh, just no, 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 no. stoop. This time, I'll run off. And who knows? I might even plan some incredibly stupid... That bathroom thing. sucks. Oh, God, I thought you were over that. Maybe I am. Maybe I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. The dialogue in this game, or at least in this scene specifically, not the greatest. Not really a fan of their interactions. Is this how regular people are? Because if so, you guys are cringe. Oh yeah, I found a collective. I'm just stealing stuff. You know, going into people's rooms, reading their private items, and stealing their rocket ships. I know, I'm so special like that. Ah, the hook ladder thing. Wow. Who the freak plays this game on their PC? Out of all the games to play, this is the one How to choose. How many times have you seen Revenge of the Bloodsuckers 2 now? 50? 60? Like, uh, fun, hun fun hundred, he's gonna say. Found it. Great. Just uh, hook it up right there. It was in your room. What do you even mean, dog? I need to find the hook ladder thing. It's in your room. What are you talking about? Alright, what are we doing in the attic? So much crap. So romantic. Well, you know what they say. One man's crap is another man's vinyl collection. What? Oh, wow. That's so clever. It's not. It, it's really not clever. They got a freaking door up here? Dog. This attic's actually not bad. I, I kind of kind of digging. Hey, look, another rocket ship for me to snag it by. Handy dandy. Rocket ship collection. Whoa. How long have you had these? You like them? They're incredible. Which one's your favorite? Hey, that shotgun from the shelf is huh? downstairs. Oh, right. Just uh, pretend they don't exist. That's what I do. They're all your mom's? Yep. I know she likes to hunt, but this is... It's what? just four, dude. Uh, I mean, she doesn't like hunting. She doesn't? She does it for work. I thought she worked in, like, uh, wildlife management. Yeah, which sometimes means population control. Yeah, managing wildlife. If, you know, a species gets out of hand, she says it's the only way to, like, um, maintain balance. Yeah, that makes sense. What you gotta do. You hear that? What? Dude, if that's her dad crying... It is. Oh my gosh. I'm a doctor. What's the point if I can't save my own wife? The hell is that? Oh! <laughs> that this is this is quite a birthday for Kenneth here. Okay. 
man's having to deal with his wife's passing, his daughter semi-flirting, and then, you know, alien invasion. Okay. Uh, where do I sign up to get that kind of birthday treatment? And that is where we're going to end this episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And I will catch you guys in the next one. See you.